Ready. Right. So we're playing contamination Wait. chess. Grand contamination chess. This is grand chess on a ten by ten board. I don't really know the rules here. Um, contamination chess, which is have your unit touching an enemy unit for one move to win, and your king cannot move to a square touching an enemy unit. You should go ahead and make a move. Oh, mess. Um, you can only, oh, oh sorry, pawns promote on the pawn line, so that's the seventh and second ranks, there's a zero rank, um, and they can only promote to pieces that have already, uh, been captured. So, like, if my queen's still on the board, it can't promote to a queen. <coughs> Another works on the back line. <coughs> no gasoline. <coughs> When it, when, it, when it says touching the enemy's king for one move, that just means like you just have to be in that square, even if it gets taken, right? So like, say if I move next year, is it like capture the kill, king of the hill? It's uh, no, it's not exactly like king of the hill. So like, if I move okay. next to your king, you have the opportunity to move away or capture my unit. So it, so it doesn't have really anything to do with, so that's, it's not like the end all be all. Of, uh, I guess so, but it is easier to checkmate than a normal chess, I would say. Totally. <clears throat> Well, shoot. That's uh, just a pawn. I mean.
So what's been going on in the world? Check. Um. Check. Let's see. Uh, just, I don't know. I'm I pretty much have my book finalized for publishing. I'm just kind of just make, I'm just kind of making a decision if uh, I should just do it with Amazon or not. Yeah, it's always the tricky part. Um, <clears throat> so I feel like the longer I don't do it, I could be losing money. But like, I don't know. I'm working on other stuff too, so I'm not. Yeah, I feel you on that. I, mean, I don't want to be in too much of a rush to. Give up tons of percentage percentage of my work, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that's how I've, I've been dealing with the same thing. Also, yeah, just uh, less serious. I just looking at some Christmas stuff for family, and I, I mean, I looked at like I looked at Black Friday and Cyber Monday stuff, and they like didn't go down, and now they just like went back up, and I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> <laughs> now. <laughs> Like, they didn't go down, like, at all, pretty much. And then they just went up after. Uh, yeah, totally. It was over. Yeah, I think I think the only time Black Friday is maybe worth it is if, price, if, is it, if it's, like, free shipping. And you're like, well, at least I'm not paying shipping. Me and Mike have been playing a lot of Bro Force. That's been really fun. Nice. I don't know that I've played that before. What is that? What is yeah. that game about? Is it Bro Force? Yeah. Uh, we haven't played it. Bro Force. Oh, awesome! It's an adult swim game. Looks like fun. Can you play with more than two people? Yep, I can play up to four. I think. Womp, 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 womp. Too quick. Check, check. So I think we can go there. Or there. Check. Check. 
We only got to play it once or so, but it was called Musketeer Chess. It's uh, where you got to pick two extra pieces. We each picked one piece. So there was like a bank of like 10 or so. And um, we each picked one piece each, and that was the two extra pieces that were on the board. Um, I wish it kind of worked like that. So what do I need to do here? Yeah, I like Musketeer Chess. I remember enjoying it. <laughs> okay, that's a check, technically, because it's touching your king. That's a check for touching the king. Yep. <laughs> I totally forgot that that was the place where you fucking turn in. But it is the bottom line, isn't it? Dang. Check. Check. Well. Nice. You go. Go, 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 that's Check. all. Check. Good game. This has contamination grand chest with a... Yeah, cool check, mate. Oh, I enjoyed that one. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll be back with another chess game real soon.